do my degree. I would I would still do my degree, no matter how how not hard, but if even though there are ups and downs in my program, I would still do it. Uh, well, I can only just speak on behalf of UP. Um, so it's a Philippine university. Uh, I think in terms of workload, there's just so much more requirements that you need to do in here in the Philippines here in the Philippines compared to um, European universities. Also, what I, what I love more about European universities is this you just feel you just obviously feel the the nurturing nurturing vibe of the of academic institutions like more so your teachers you feel to them that it's not really I am the teacher you are the student it's really more of a mentorship it's a mentoring process so what can I offer you I mean what what can I learn from you what what you can learn from me so it's really more of a two-way thing rather than I feed uh, rather than in most universities here in the Philippines it's more like <coughs> sorry it's more of these are the things you need to learn so just do it um, I know right now you're probably you're probably searching for that really good scholarship or you're applying right now or you're probably about to send that application right now I know in the long run it might not be always a good it, it, it might not be always a, um, a good result, but you just have to do it. Even though you fail, do it again and again because it keeps you on your... I mean, studying abroad, even though it's in Asia, within Asia, Europe, US, Australia, just the whole idea of studying somewhere else gives you... A leverage in terms of your like, job prospects second is just in terms of like whole growth like personality development I cannot stress even further how effective and how helpful it is to be studying abroad um, so just do it and you're probably doubting right now but you're probably like problematizing of what should what if this this did not happen what if i have to pay no just hit that send button <laughs> so if you have more questions just visit a friendabroad.com